Okay, so <clears throat> like I mentioned, I'm going to be summoning on the uh, the Yuffing banner again. I only have like 300 bookmarks. I didn't get uh, I didn't get all all of them back. <clears throat> I got a little bit, but obviously not. I didn't really try because uh, I started burning gold. Um, so I figured, you know, if I need more bookmarks, I'll just get them out of the the little packs. So we'll burn these 300, and then uh, we'll see where we go from there. Also, the other thing is we're getting our uh, Zerato recall. Um, let's go see really quickly. We're in the Zerato recall, so I'm gonna trade that in for General Pergus if I don't get him. Uh, well, I mean, yeah. So I'm gonna trade that in for General Pergus, but it's good to summon um, beforehand. So I'm gonna summon to see uh, if I get some. I have one miss. Uh, one. ML summon right now. I'm gonna get some of those little uh, gold transmit stones. Probably get another uh, summon. So we'll see how we end up uh, after that. And then I'll get the recall and I'll do that. But so that's that's the other reason I'm uh, I'm summoning as well. Uh, so the Shermia seems pretty good, but I'm probably gonna pull for her. I already have Watcher Shuri and Yufin. Um, they they tend to do the job pretty well. Uh, so let's just yeah let's just get in here. Um, my, as you saw, my inventory was full. Uh, Ruel's here because I have a second Ruel. I should, maybe I should gear that one, but eh, I've got too many other characters to gear. Let's do the free daily summon real quick. Nothing. <clears throat> uh, Aqua Rose. Uh, Briarbush, I said. Actually, I want to see who the next rotation was. So, Bologna, Etika Scepter. That rotation is not that good. I don't plan on summoning for her. Uh, of course, you know, something might come out where I might want to, but as of now, uh, she's not, like, a biggest priority for me. So I think I'm just going to hold on to all my Mystic Medals and wait for, to see who's next. Um, but yeah, so, yeah, let's get back to what we're here to do. So let's just start pulling on this. I have enough to go to Pity in terms of, like, you know, with the crystals and all that stuff. Uh... I prefer not to, but uh, you know, another Pearl Horizon. Uh, Pearl Horizon specialty change. Pearl Horizon, sorry. PH's specialty change uh, makes you feel like a, a less useful. Oh, there's another one. A less useful. Uh, what's her name? Tenebria. So she has a 35% chance to sleep, and then if she hits someone who's asleep, uh, she she does more damage, and now she defense breaks. Um, but like, well, she stuns as well, right? But like, the sleep is already just the stun. So if you take Tenebria's S three, it's already got the AOE, the sleep, the defense, and the defense break. And if you wanna, if you really want the stun that badly, I mean, go ahead and run a um, Abyssal Crown on her, and and you'll be just, you know, you'll be just as good. Uh, but yeah, so that's kind of what I thought was kind of interesting about uh, her specialty change. It just seemed like a very single target, like um, Tenebria. Which is, I mean, it's, it's alright, I guess, for people who don't have Tenebria, but yeah, like, if any of you have seen my, my stuff already, you know that I use Tenebria quite a lot. Uh, so yeah, so we're gonna go until we get another Yufin. Um, hopefully we get the artifact before then, but if not, then, I mean, I'm not gonna go any further. Um, like I said, like, I already have one, so pulling again for a second one. I'm not really pulling again for a second one, I'm pulling for an artifact, but, uh, I'm obviously not gonna complain about a second one. Just that uh, it'd be a little underwhelming considering uh, what I'm actually after in this case. Uh, so Briar Witch Hysteria looks pretty interesting. Um, so far I've been seeing some like conflicting information on whether or not she stacks with uh, Drink. I wouldn't see why she wouldn't. Let's see what this is. I wouldn't see why she wouldn't stack with Drink. But, uh, you know... If she doesn't, then she doesn't, right? It's like, it is what it is. Oh my gosh. I already have... I think I have enough for, like, two... To triple less my other... Because I have a Blaze Dingo, and then I have a regular Dingo. I'm not sure what the regular one is at, in terms of, like, how many I have. But I think I have, like, six of them. Which is pretty crazy. Um, but yeah, I don't know why it wouldn't stack. Maybe they just... Oh, pawn, please. Cool, very good. Okay. Uh, this For one, this will help like speed up the side story stuff, and two, uh, 
it's not wholly useful right now. I'm, I'm starting to look at. I'm, I'm playing around with her with the um, burn build with the junkyard dog, so I'm probably not going to use this on her. But uh, effectiveness, chance to stun, yeah. But I think in the future there might be someone who who takes like really good advantage of, of what this has to offer. So I mean, it's always good to have just at least one copy of the limited artifacts. Um, it's already burned twenty summons. The question is, do I want to go until I get the second uh, Ufine, or should I just save? I feel like I should just save, but I'm in kind of a mood to make bad decisions. Let's go put this here. So I'm one away from another one here, so let's just, uh, I'm just going to summon a couple more times. Real quick, let's see. Because we, let's see. Uh, we, oh, uh, that was four, actually. I needed. Uh, we could very well, like hit the pity even though I didn't hit the pity the first time so it wouldn't be that bad but uh, it's always something to consider. Oh please let this be her. The ML summon on this last one. Oh it's not. Okay that's fine too. Um, but so I haven't used her in any content um, because I haven't used her in any content because uh, she's uh, not six starred yet. Um, and I was waiting to get this copy to use her to imprint herself to get to the five star just to save me uh, some fodder. Um, but yeah, I, I think it's not that big a deal. It's, well, I mean, her imprint is also attack percentage for herself, which is I mean, obviously that's what she wants. But uh, let's just go summon these real quick in the middle of the video. Okay, so we didn't get anything off of that to be expected. Uh, Requiem Roar. Requiem Roar. They all have these like really weird names. Uh, let's go pull. Let's go grab these. Pearl Horizon, Requiem Roar, Carmen Rose is like the easiest one. Uh, what's the other ones? Gloomy Rain is pretty easy. Okay, let's try again. Okay, we got nothing. So obviously this is what I get for uh, pulling um, Arbiter early. Uh, but yeah, so okay. That's that. I'm really kind of torn between summoning for her and uh, not summoning for her, I guess, is the, uh, the conundrum there. Uh, her last day is in, in a week. I think we'll see how we'll see how things go. Um, I was expecting this to go a little longer than it did, um, but she's going to be here for a week. So it's probably better to just hold off until the end of the week and then uh, see and see where uh, what comes after. Uh, I really don't think there's going to be anything like another limited or anything super crazy after, and I don't need anything that's not limited anymore. Uh, I mean, Charon is always good. Um, yeah, I mean, it's always going to be good stuff to summon on, but there's nothing I like. I have to pull because it's going to go away or something like that. Um, especially like I, I don't know. I feel like they might do like something. They haven't done one yet, but like a winter limited unit would be pretty interesting to see. Uh, but by the time that rolls out, it's like I should have bookmarks and all that stuff. Um, but uh, in terms of in the near future, I don't think there's much to summon on. Um, we didn't get any news today either of any future banners. Everybody's just kind of sitting around drooling over. Um, I think I'll just, you know, I'm just gonna keep summoning for a while. Oh, okay. Well, here's a, here's a gold. Please tell me this is her. It'd be hilarious. Oh, come on. Oh. Uh, Coley. I actually have quite a few Coleys, but uh, I need to merge them into my A Coley. I don't want to like just shove them in there because my Coley is level five and they're obviously level four, so I want to like level them up to level five and then like use them as uh, level five fodder to get her to level six. Um, yeah, I guess we're I guess we're summoning. I mean, maybe we'll get lucky again. Uh, yeah, but you always want like at least one of the artifacts um, because. You can always just bottle it later if it ends up being like very powerful. Um, but like I said, it's like the artifact is not like the greatest thing, but uh, 
It looks like, I mean, someone might come out and make it really useful. Ooh, we're getting pretty dry here. I'm kind of glad that uh, I got all the... Um, so I finished all the imprint, like the triple S imprint uh, challenges from the uh, the whatever. The thing that tracks like just random challenges or whatever. Um, and for those of you, like if you get a bunch of three stars, you want to keep doing, you want to keep feeding them into their own copies to increase that uh, imprint thing. Uh, to get the... To get the um, the bookmarks out of that, because those are very useful. Um, but like that's, that's that's kind of what I was going into was like, I'm kind of like glad I don't have to save them anymore, because uh, I finished that and I can't get any bookmarks or any of that. But like, so yeah, it does kind of sucks. Not you're losing a, a bit of bookmark income there. Um, I think, uh, funnily enough, like it, it's pretty dry in terms of bookmarks after you you burn a lot of that stuff. Especially like for end game players, like there's really not a whole lot of um, recourse for getting more bookmarks other than just like using your your crystal to to buy them, uh, or just buy or just sort of buying like uh, stuff that has bookmarks in it, like packs and stuff. Um, but yeah, like it, it's not it's not the it's not the worst, obviously. I mean, ah, it's not the worst, uh, but it's still it does kind of suck that. Uh, Wow, we're getting a lot of uh, shiny now in a row here, making up for that dry spell. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, like it, like I said, it's not the worst. Uh, we can also still sort of like, I mean, I'm doing pretty well, right? And, and I like hit endgame a long time ago, but uh, it definitely you there is a a sort of um, a dry spot uh, at the uh, the upper end of the game once uh, once once you've hit endgame, you don't get they don't throw a whole lot of bookmarks at you. How many do I have? 63 bookmarks? That's like 12 summons. Well, it's looking like we're not going to get her uh, early. So I'll have to think about whether I want to... Um... Whether I want to uh, continue summoning with uh, Crystal. Uh, we'll see, like I said, we'll see in about a week. See how things turn out. Um, but yeah, so we got 33 bookmarks. Um, it's a lot of three star fodder. Ooh, here you go. Come on. You know you want to. Ugh. Uh, it was actually pretty good because I need Leo imprints for uh, Roaming Warrior Leo because he looks ridiculous. He can. If he soul burns. He can S3, activate his S2, pop the bombs, reduce your cooldowns, and now you're stunned, more damage, uh, and the, the S3 cooldown is reduced, so he can do it again uh, very shortly. Um, yeah, he, he looks excessively irritating. Um, but you're gonna need a lot of effectiveness, of course, to, to land those bombs. Um, how, effect, how useful he'll be, like in uh, high-end PvP, uh, it's still to be determined considering uh, a lot of guys there have high effective resistance or like they just uh, so it's 400 yeah so that's it for today uh, glad we got the um, the artifact at least one uh, it'll help with the side story as well getting more um, resources just finishing that up quicker um, but yeah so yeah like I said it's all for today I'm gonna go recall my uh, my Zerato and get that Pergus and uh, start getting my my speedy wyvern team online. <laughs>